life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Thus began a revolution. But how could such positive and beautiful words lead to armed conflict, to loss of life and property? Because the desire for such a positive atmosphere created the motivation to do what was necessary to achieve such positive and noble ideals. Have Americans achieved these cherished values? And if so, have they been tested? And have they been protected? Yes, from others who wanted to destroy us. Our nation has been tested repeatedly through wars. For example, because of their bravery and their sacrifice, the Americans of World War II were given the title of the greatest generation. Did they secure those three principles for themselves? Yes. But the final chapter of their lives is not yet complete. The children of the greatest generation have also received a name. They are called the baby boomers. And it is these children that may well bring into greater focus whether their retirement and their senior years will complete their final days as their parents had hoped and had sacrificed. For we know that many of the baby boomers are not ready for the realities that longevity brings. If age and ailments extend your life beyond your personal means and you are placed in the care of whatever system can care for you, what is your quality of life? And does that bring into question one's own sense of personal liberty? And in that condition, how are you to continue the pursuit of happiness? Or does it become illusory? This industry provides help and solutions to millions of Americans. 